Interesting. There we go. Uh, clairvoyance. Clairvoyance activates whenever you cleanse a totem. When empty-handed, hold the ability button to unlock your full aura reading potential for up to 8 seconds. You can see the auras of exegates, switches, generators, hooks, and chests. Within f uh, 64 meter range. Um, okay, I feel like no one's going to use that. A boon that offers comfort and Mr. Terror. Press and hold the ability button near a dull or hex totem to bless it and create a boon totem. Soft chimes ring out in a 28 meter range. Any survivor within the boon totem's range gain a 90% healing speed bonus and can heal themselves without needing a med kit. Okay. You can only bless one totem at a time. All equipped with boon perks are active on your boon totem. Hmm. 90% speed. So pretty much 100%. 100% faster. So that's like a wheel make it on yourself, isn't it? Well, that's level one. You're right. It will be 100%, won't it? Oh, no. It'll be the meter range. Wait. We should do this. This is the way you find the proper ones. Okay. Uh, 64 meter range. That one's kind of crap though. I don't, I, I don't see people, uh, using that at all. Maybe, maybe newer players. So this, yeah, 100%. 100%. So it's like a wheel maker on yourself, isn't it? Right? Wow. Eight second self-heal. Is that what it is? So you can just run there and just eight second self-heal. Yeah, that, that's definitely one what people might think about, at least experiment with. Um, RRE, thank you for the 12 months. BTB already, yeah? It is indeed. Jake, the uh, four months as well. Dead Man Risen for the 20 months. Uh, hey, Sensei. Uh, sensei. Uh, love and appreciate the content. Keep it up, brother. Appreciate Math Man for the four months. Supersonic for the 95 bits. Uh, did you read the plagues? Nuka? I said that. No. Uh, Ari for the five months. JM for the sub. Uh, game for the sub as well. Appreciate it. If I missed anyone, I very much appreciate the support. Uh, press all the ability button near a dull or hex totem. Um, so it's a 28 meter range again. Any survivors within uh, the boon totem's range will have their scratch marks and auras hidden to the killer. This effect lingers for four seconds after leaving the boon totem's range. You can bless one totem at a time. Hmm. Scratch marks and auras hidden. That could be kind of strong. The strongest one feels like it's this one. This one's whatever. That doesn't matter. No one's going to use that. Which will put, it'll probably mean the devs will buff it. And it'll be like, uh, you can also see the killer's aura or something stupid. But that that's that for now. Uh, this one I feel is the one people are going to experiment with. And this one uh, might have more potential than we think. I am will this perk, yeah. Go to barbecue, yeah. Um. All right, let's see. Should we? Should we see if we can actually get normal games on the PTB? Oh shit! All the killer nerfs as well. I forgot about that. <laughs> I just went straight to the boon stuff. Uh, Twenty-eight meters. It is a lot, yeah. Damn, I only can get one. I probably get more actually. Let's... Let's just try one of these boon totems to see see how they are. There's a lot to try out now. It's overwhelming. It keeps moving. See so her uh, outfits uh, after this. I've already uh, loaded them. The game graphics improved. Uh, from when? Uh, 
Uh, X Bor Saru, thank you for the 12 months. Appreciate it, man. Hi, Chu. How are you today? Uh, I'm alright. How are you doing? We might need to do a, a private lobby, maybe. But no. BTBs are a bit awkward trying to get games because the devs don't just make everyone play with everyone. Um, well, I mean, I, I think sometimes they, they might have done that. They, they seem to take a while for some reason. New killer as well. No, just a new survivor to introduce the boon totems. Survivor will be okay. We will be able to get games with survivor. I'm thinking about killer. Killer's the one that takes a while. <laughs> That's funny. Shadow step. Oh, yeah, they, they buffed that, didn't they? Wait, the hell? I'm getting all the, the new buffed things. Interesting. Very coincidental. All right, let's see. Let's see how these uh, boons are. I'm very curious. Did I equip one? Yeah, I equipped uh, Shadow Step and the Healing one and Vigil, I think. Oh no, and any means necessary. So I could just find a totem and just put it on, alright, let's see. Well, uh, Lisberg, thank you for the 10 bits. I uh, missed my earlier bits. Uh, Lisberg for the 100 bits. Uh, put the healing boo close to a main building with a god loop and you can just heal yourself in the middle of a chase laughing my ass off. Yeah, maybe. I mean, there is one that always spawns here, actually, a lot of the time. Now that I've said it, it isn't here, but... Usually it is. Oh shit! God damn it! I wanted to find a freaking boon totem. Now I won't be able to. I wonder if I. Oh, I found a thing. Oh, boon totem. Oh wow, so I can just run over here? And then I get all my effects from it, right? Wait, here? Oh, that's interesting. That's actually quite quite big uh, radius. Bigger than I kind of thought for some reason. And in this whole radius, we have no footsteps and all that kind of stuff. Quite loud. So at least the killer will be able to hear it. I wonder if the killer can see this. No, I can't put mine on another tome. I don't think so. I'll actually check. Holy crap, that's a big radius. You can have two of them. You can have these all over the map. Go on, hook. I will. I'm just. I'm testing this. This isn't a proper game. You can have these all over the map. Wow. She got rid of it. Now, does she get her... Oh, she does... Does she get her ruin back, or does it go? <laughs> Bro, 
Wow, it gets rid of Ruin. And then I can just bless it again. <laughs> How fast does she destroy it? Okay, it looks like she destroys it quickest, but it gets rid of her perk. And you can just have them all around the map. All these healing totem things. Interesting. Can I see how fast it does it? Don't, don't grab me. Whatever, she might grab me. I'm boring. Boring! You reckon she want to boop him? <sighs> it's so obvious as well. I didn't boop. Yeah, maybe. I just wanted to see how fast she breaks it. That's all I wanted to see. I I, I can see it with her anyway. Let's see how quick she breaks it. Let's see how quick it breaks. Oh, he wants to heal. Oh, you got boobed here. Can you can you break it? Okay. So it only takes about two seconds. Hmm. I wonder how easy they are to find for killer as well. Does the killer see the tome as well? No, there's one over there she hasn't found. Yeah, that's crazy. So you bless their hex. You get to keep the totem for yourself. Oops. You get to keep the totem for yourself. If they hit it, they don't break the totem. And then you can just re-bless it. And you can just have these, these totems all the way through the map, can you? You wanna heal, man? Yeah, you can just keep blessing them. Uh, I saw a funny thing mentioned. If the boon totem, uh, if both boon totems are used, the killer can't see survivors healing themselves with nurses. Well, no, of course not. Look, here's a hex perk, but I'm a survivor. And survivor is stronger. <laughs> so... Instead of breaking the hex perk and telling the killer exactly where I'm at, I, I can do this, and then... Now it's mine. And then the killer needs to go and kick it out, but when he kicks it out, there's no hex anymore, and it's just a dull tone for me to use whenever I want, right? And that's the radius of where I can heal, and I have no footsteps. Uh, no um, scratch marks. I do need to use per two perks for that. I don't, I don't see people using both perks. Um, but I see the healing one. Hmm. And luckily the, um, the perks aren't too crazy though, right? At least, at least that's the silver line. You want healing? Come with me. Look. Let me heal you really quick. Unless the killer can see them. I think she's actually, uh, oh, there she is. You trusted me.
Hey, look, I can just re-bless it now. Did I get it or no? I didn't. Blessed totems also count in Norwed. Hmm. Yeah, you can put it out really quick, which is nice, but it means that the uh, the killer needs to run and looking for them. I honestly feel the only uh, threat boon perk is probably uh, this one. But you could fuck with Shadow Step. Like, you could have one person have uh, the Circle of Healing, and then one person having Shadow Step, and that's it. Everyone gets it, right? I think. I think that's how it works. No, actually, maybe it isn't. I can't remember. No, they both need it, right? They both need it. If they cleanse something, I get my boon talks, uh, my boon perks from that thing, don't I? That's the one. Like if they if they bless a totem, I get my boon uh, perks from that totem, don't I? Or do I only get their boon to perks? Only your boons are active on the totem you blessed. So why why did I get? Did, were I using someone else's boom perks then, I assume, then? Okay. Interesting. Alright, well, that's a whole new kind of mechanic they threw on us. 